Naomba tuweze kumpulia makofi. Despite the county having made enormous strides in addressing the plight of persons with disabilities, this critical group remains disadvantaged with policy planners appearing to have overlooked some of their concerns. A fact that Nicodemus Macau, a person with disability, has on many occasions grappled with in his daily struggles to make ends meet. Ile kitu nataka tu, ni kwanza tukuwe na resource centers. Mahali mahali tunaweza kuenda wale mabu wafanya more trainings, kuhusu business development, na pia kuhusu mambo na empowerment. Kama chini tunaisi huko kibila ma, mitaa ya mapandani, kuna mitaru, mule mabu hata hawezi kuka bali kama hapo. His is a challenge shared by many of his kind who on friendlier policies targeted at their welfare. They are concerned appearing to have been partially addressed at least through a bill that is said to be tabled before the National Assembly on Wednesday in an effort to make their lives a bit bearable. I will introduce a bill in Parliament to make accessibility to public transport mandatory and that there will be penalties for those who then don't make accessibility to their own circles. We want circles. Uh, if they have matatus, 20 matatus, 10% of those matatus must be matatus that can be used by persons with disability. The bill sponsored by nominated MP Dr. David Sankok proposes penalties for those who fail to comply with the law. It also proposes the establishment of special walkways in major towns across the country for use by persons with a disability. The bill also proposes the incorporation of Braille naming of the streets as well as enabling voice prompts for street lights to enable those with visual impairment to hear the prompts. You know, with a traffic light, it is either green, uh, red or orange, but there is somebody who cannot read, uh, who cannot see. So we want a talking uh, light so that when it is time for a pedestrian to cross, also people who are blind can know that it is crossing. This even as the draft of the bill challenged persons with disabilities to take advantage of government initiatives to empower themselves. The people living with disability, we need opportunities, not sympathy. We have now to get out of this feature circle of seeking sympathy. We have abilities, there is ability beyond disability. We need to come out and work and seek those opportunities. There is opportunities of 5% employment. Please be aggressive enough. Make sure that you are employable. Aye, 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 aye. And as Kenya joined the rest of the world in marking the International Day of Disabled Persons, the latest development offers a ray of hope for the critical group that has relied on good Samaritans to board public service vehicles. Hey, hey, sure. Bye, bye. Sure. Yeah. Aye, 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 aye.